Now, U.S. Republican lawmaker George Santos, who is infamous for fabricating his life story, pleaded not guilty to charges that he allegedly duped donors, stole from his campaign and lied to Congress about being a millionaire. He is also accused of cheating to collect unemployment benefits that he did not deserve. Exiting the courthouse today, Santos said that the probe is a witch hunt and that he is planning to run for re-elections. I'm going to keep fighting. I'm going to keep fighting for what I believe in. I'm going to keep fighting to represent my district. I'm going to keep fighting to deliver results. And now I have to keep fighting to deliver, uh, you know, to, to defend my innocence. And I'm going to do that. Santos was later released on a $500,000 bond following his arraignment, which uh, lasted for 15 minutes. He could now face up to 20 years in prison if convicted. Santos had been charged with seven counts of wire fraud, three counts of money laundering, one count of theft of public funds, and two counts of making materially false statements to the House of Representatives. The Republican lawmaker has also been accused of lying about his finances on congressional disclosures, applying and receiving unemployment benefits while he was employed as the regional director of an investment firm. Nine House Republicans have so far called on Santos to resign. But Santos has clearly said that he has no intention of resigning and would run for re-election in 2024. The Republican lawmaker has said that he will vote on the border bill tomorrow.